YouTube, what's going on? My name is Dylan DSR Knowledge, and today we are doing an unboxing video again because it's been too long. It's been too long since we've done an unboxing video on this channel. I'm hiding over here. So, this is the Canon Pixima TS9020 printer. It is a wireless printer. It can do mobile device printing. Not that I'll probably use it. It's probably just going to be mainly... I'm hiding over here. Probably mainly just going to be for me doing small prints and stuff like that. I do want to get into... There. A little more light over here. No, I'm not so hidden. Um, I do want to get into doing some small print photography and stuff like that. Maybe sell a few prints of some of my, uh, my favorite stuff. Um, eventually I'll have a website up. I have it designed and everything. I just haven't uh, dropped the coin to have it uh, published because I don't want to have like a sub sub website name under it. Eventually it will be the Sterling Imagery.com. Eventually. As long as now that I've said that nobody steals it. Um, but yes, eventually that's gonna be up where you can buy prints and stuff or you can contact me from there. As always I'll have all the links to my photography page um, in the description below. So my my Facebook, my Twitter, Instagram, um, Tumblr, stuff like that'll all be in the description. So if you do, please check that out. Um, if you have any of those accounts Drop a follow on them. Makes me feel great about myself. Really makes me appreciate everything you guys do for me even that much more. I mean, I already appreciate everything you do, especially with the YouTube channel and everything, but photography is also another big passion of mine, so I would appreciate it if you guys drop a like on some of that stuff too. Um, but let's get right into this unboxing. I have no clue what to expect in the box outside of a printer and cables and your average stuff. We got a black and red theme going on. I got black and red shirt on, black hat, black and red printer. All right. So, let's take this open up. Oh. Just down on the side. Put that over there before I injure myself. Okay, first thing out. Slide this forward. Pretty sure these are ink cartridges. Let's see how this works. I think this little dealy flips out. Um, yeah, so we've got our individual ink cartridges. I'm pretty sure most of the colors are individual in there. Holy cow, we got a ton of them. Um, get these all. This must be a black one. So we got all of that. We do have a cable right here. Power cable. Pretty standard. Get this out of the way. Oh, and then we got some styrofoam. And... Oh, yeah. No other cables or nothing in there. Get the box out of the way. Rip these bad boys off. Uh, oh, look at this thing. I had it totally upside down. Go figure. Oh, yes. Get this out of here. All right. Look at this thing. If you guys didn't know, my favorite colors are black and red, so obviously this was the, the perfect starter printer for me. I'm going to rip this stuff off right away. Oh, look at that. Now, as far as I know, the TS9020 is the, the top of the line for the Pixima TS series. Um, and it's really quite an affordable printer, too. It's not outrageously expensive, but... They said that as far as like starter photography, this is probably one of the better printers to go with. I mean, obviously you could go all out and spend a bajillion dollars on a printer, but um, this one's actually really affordable and I didn't spend anything on it. I actually got this as a gift for my three year anniversary with my girlfriend. So thank you very much for the gift. I greatly appreciate it. And we've had a great three years and many more to come. So. You can't beat that. Not only, not only is it oh, exactly what I wanted for a printer, but I got it for free as a gift. Not really for free. Somebody paid for it, but my lovely lady friend paid for it. Okay. And here, crumpled up. Great job, whoever packaged this. Picks them a starting guide. Not that you can tell that. I'm probably going to figure that out on my own. What do we got? We've got our, our setup instructions here. 
upside down and in various languages. English, French, Dutch, Italian, Spanish. I don't know the rest of those. Oh, what do we got in this little bag of here? More stuff. More safety and important information. Read me first. I'm supposed to read this. All right, what do we got here? Canon, the limited warranty set for below. Okay, awesome. As always, Canon usually sends kind of these little booklet things. Oh, it looks like I've got, is this actually photo paper? This might have came with a little bit of photo paper. Sample paper pack, try it. Canon's own photo paper. Oh, that's really cool. I got really small, a few really small glossy photo papers. I mean, they're, I don't know. You can cut them into like wallet ones or something, I don't know. But no, really small ones, which is cool. Awesome, awesome. Canon, I will definitely try your photo paper, but I have a feeling your photo paper is also quite expensive, but who knows? If I really like it, I'll buy it. And tap the app, tap print and enjoy for the mobile printing. Like I said, I don't know if I'll utilize the mobile printing on this that much, just because I'm going to have it hooked up to my computer where I do all my editing and everything anyway, so I don't know. Who knows? Maybe I'll get, I'll get, uh, ecstatic someday and with this S8 take some really nice pictures and whip them up on that app on there and then uh, and then just print them right off and see what happens. I don't know. The S8 does take really good pictures too. Uh, what else do we got? I don't know what this is. I ripped it off and the door came with it. So, Oh, there's the USB plug. There's the printer, printer cable plug. I don't know. There's a little plastic piece in here. I'm going to put that back before I break stuff. Put this back on there. Okay. So, top feed paper tray. Coolio. What do we got? What do we got in front here? I'm just going to get all this stuff. Oh, I got a disc. I have a software disc for OS Windows. My laptop doesn't even have a disk tray anymore, so if this is something super important, I'm sure, Canon, you've got a link for me on your website. All right. Oh, holy cow, look at all the stuff that I get to rip off yet. Lift this thing up. Oh, very nice. So, wow, look at that. Isn't that neat? This is obviously where the scanner is on there, copier scanner. There's so much stuff here. I don't know where to start. Ooh, just start ripping everything off. Why not? Get right into it. Much there. Oh, look at that. So shiny and glossy. Ooh. Why don't we close this back down? Lift this bad boy up. Take this bad boy off. That's where all the ink goes. This all over here. I really should. I really should start having like garbages next to me when I do unboxing videos. This table is a little. I think I gotta fix the the feet on this table because we're. Yeah, we're just. This is not uh, not uh, sexual whatsoever. Um, okay. So we have ink. We have lots of little canister things here, and I'm just gonna tear into them. This one's blue. It has a C on it. Therefore, I'm gonna tear all this off. Maybe. I, try, I tried to tear off, so okay. This is what I have this for. I'm gonna go real gently. No, nope. there we go. So that's done. Uh, presumably this little orange cap thingy comes off. Maybe. I don't know. I'm just gonna... Maybe not. Does it? I, I would think that this is a little safety thing. This is why they tell you to read the instructions. Okay, so that's out. I'm gonna reel that back down. I want to, is, is this how I load it? I might have to have this turned on before I can actually load it, huh? That's probably the smart thing to do. How do I get this bad boy? Is there a button? I don't know. I'm just breaking stuff now. Oh, okay. Before we get into that, why don't I start, you know, just turn stuff. Oh, look at that. There's a paper tray that slides out. Wowzers. I feel like this does something too, but, you know. This little orange strip off the bottom of here. Perfect. Oh, look at that. You can print CDs on here. I don't know if people still do that. 
in my day and age, most of the photography that I do is gonna be digital and, you know, like, sent through Facebook or something. So, so I probably won't need that all too much. Wow, look at all these cool little gizmos and gadgetries, and I don't know what all this is actually for, but it's cool. I mean, there's that. Oh, rip this bad boy off, rip this bad boy off. There's an SD card slot on the bottom there, so if you know if you're shooting out there and you, you really like what you've got on your camera, you can just slap the SD right in there and print right off that. And this does have with this touch screen and everything, it does have a couple preset like edited ones. Like I think there's a black and white one and probably like an antique style one or like a sapia tone style one, you know, a bunch of different stuff like that. So I mean that's pretty cool. If if you're really if you're just a beginner photographer and you go out and you take some pictures on your SD card and you just slap it right in there. You can get a couple quick presets as far as, you know, like filter style things, just like you would if you upload something to Instagram. It's got a few filters in it. And you can print it off just like that. So, I mean, if you don't have, you know, Lightroom or Photoshop that you're going through and editing um, your photos in, like, intensively, this thing can do a little bit for you. So that's pretty nice. This be a bottom-fed paper tray. I'm literally just ripping stuff apart, so don't mind me. I might end up breaking something and then being upset with myself, but that's all right. Let's hope that that doesn't happen, but if it happens, it happens. Oh, okay, this slides under here, just like that. And then what does it do from there? I don't know what it does from there. Oh, okay. So this little tray, you can change the, you know, if you're doing just a small, like, portrait size, or not portrait size, but like a small little picture that's going to fit into a smaller picture frame. You can expand it out and whatnot, slide it down for larger stuff. That's pretty neat. That's all under here. That's the disc tray. What else? This must be a paper tray. <laughs> slide that back in. Slide this in before I break it. This down. Let's figure out how this thing goes down. I don't really just want to force it down because it looks like it. Oh, oh! I just got to lift up a little more. Perfect. All right. Let's slap this down. I think I still have. Oh yeah. Oh. Oh. Wowzers. I'm breaking stuff. All right. This comes off here. This comes off here. I think this comes off here. Oh, maybe. At some point it does. There we go. Awesome, awesome, awesome. I don't know what any of these little red things down here do. It doesn't look like they do anything. They just... Okay. Awesome. Other than that, it's a printer. Yes, it's a printer. It's a scanner. It's... I don't think it does faxes because that's just, you know, who does faxes anymore. But, awesome. That's all set. Everything's back in place. It looks great. It's black and red. It's my favorite colors. I can't complain. I am not going to edit this video because I am just super lazy as far as editing goes right now. So you're probably going to get this whole upload just raw and the way it is. And I'm just going to ask that you guys, you know, still still like it and drop a thumbs up on it. Just because it, it really makes me happy. And it makes my day when people drop thumbs up on my video and they share it and they tell other people about it and then when people subscribe to my channel it makes me smile just like that as always guys thank you so much in all seriousness um i'm super excited to have a printer so i can start doing small print and stuff like that especially for family and friends and stuff just so i can have some kind of you know base in the the print world because right now all I've been doing is digital and social media stuff like that as far as photography goes and that's great and that's how most of it's going to be but it's nice to still be able to have like a, a physical print that you can hang on to or eventually I can do like giveaways and stuff like that of, of photography not that anybody you know just wants a straight up giveaway but you know hopefully there are people out there that would that would like my photography enough to, to hang it up on their wall or something so that would be you know super cool with something in the future to do so as always Thank you guys so very much. I said that already, but you guys know it. Doses. I'm not gonna run over here and grab the camera because, like I said, I'm not gonna edit it. You're gonna see me running over here in my beautiful face. <laughs>